Hey there, it's Vicki Marie. I am back from Sam's Club. John's behind the camera. Say Hello. hi. <laughs> I'm just gonna show you guys really quick what I got. We are getting ready for a family picnic slash birthday parties slash summer celebration. We're gonna have uh, maybe eight to 10 people uh, total in our backyard. So I just ran over to Sam's Club to get some backyard barbecue food. So that's what this hall is, y'all. A backyard barbecue family get together hall. And it's as easy peasy because I am not really doing a lot of cooking. So pretty much this is everything we're gonna need. So let me start with the ice cream. That way we can get it put away. All right. So yeah, it's starting to melt. So this is the member's mark. It's just, that's just water condensation. Um, this is the member's mark, super premium vanilla ice cream. This stuff is so good. Uh, it really is creamy, super yummy. And we're gonna go get that in the freezer uh, right now. I'm gonna look at the camera. <laughs> Yay. All right, that stuff is really, really good. Now, next, I'm gonna do the potato salad. I bought some of this Member's Mark Southern Style potato salad, and this is a pretty big thing, 80 ounce. I'm gonna have all of the prices on the screen. Uh, it's five pounds. This will be more than enough for all of us. And um, yep, five pound Southern Style potato salad. And I didn't have to even use the stove. So we've got that. Now this next item is uh, also a dairy thing, but it's not gonna be probably part of our picnic. This is a Harvati and Gouda uh, snack cheese that we buy all the time and uh, from Arla. I've hauled this before. This is John's really yummy favorite cheese uh, to go with crackers and wine. And I got not one, but two of the Harvati Gouda sneeze, pa uh, sneeze packs. Cheese packs. All right, John, there you go. Refrigerator. Refrigerator. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Now, the next thing is let's do the meat so we can get this put away. Because the meat is really the heart of the picnic. We all know that. <laughs> I got some of these. Um, these are the baby back pork ribs. These were, I paid $17.94 for one rack. They were five, um, I'll put the price on the screen, but five, like, well, this was on sale for four something a pack. But actually, I paid $5 and something uh, a pound, a pound. So now, they had these at Sam's Club, the pork baby back ribs in a pack with three big, what do you call them, slabs of ribs, racks of ribs, three big racks. I didn't need that much. And there was a couple next to me who were eyeing the pork ribs as well. And they were like, oh, I just don't need three racks of them. Um, so we were both, we we're all three standing there talking about this. And I was asking the man about how to pick out, you know, what, what other options I had. And the man behind the counter in the meat department said, hey, you know what? I can take the pack and split it for you. So we did. So I came home with just the amount I needed and my new friends took home what they needed. So never hesitate to ask your friendly meat guy at the counter uh, to help you out there. So that was really nice of him. And I got a big thing of hamburger because uh, we're gonna have ribs. John's gonna be cooking ribs in the smoker. We're gonna do hot dog, or not hot, we are doing hot dogs. <laughs> That's next, but we're doing hamburger. And I'm gonna put this again on the screen, the price. This is, uh, this is about, mm, I don't even know. I don't have my reading glasses on. I'll put it all on the screen. But I paid 18, about $18 for that uh, much hamburger. And then we did get some hot dogs. The ballpark Franks, and these are um, 24 count. So that's plenty, that's more than enough. And you guys, I love my hot dogs, so. I also bought some more of the oven roasted turkey breast. I probably will not use this for the picnic, but I had to pick that up because we like that to go. I like to eat this sometimes. I just roll it up with like a cheese slice, a pickle, and that's lunch every now and then. It's really good. And then I think that's all the, well, that's all the refrigerated things. So, I did get a few produce items. I bought a big thing of the Valley Pearl uh, green grapes. This is 1.36, it's three pounds, uh, three pounds of green grapes. I will put some of these out tomorrow. Their grapes are always really, really good in my opinion. Oh, here's some more, I forgot about this stuff. Okay, I did buy the cheese collection. This is the Cracker Cut Members Mark. Um, cheese collection cheese. There is uh, 32 ounces, so it's two pounds of cheese, and it's got mild cheddar, 
Swiss, Colby Jack, and Pepper Jack. I'm gonna actually put this out and the people can choose whatever kind of cheese they want on their hamburger and whatever we don't use tomorrow, we'll go with cheese and crackers and wine. Let's see. I bought some tomatoes and these are the sunset tomatoes on the vine. This is a nice big, uh, quite a few. I will put this on the screen, but let's just see. There's like two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, about ten tomatoes in there. So, and they're a good size. So these are always so good. Again, they are the sunset uh, inspired flavor sunset. I bought some lettuce and I just got the um, the, the the iceberg lettuce, two heads of it, uh, because that's the best for hamburgers. And then I like to use the lettuce like this, uh, get a couple leaves and use it instead of a bun for my hamburger. That's usually how I eat my hamburgers and even uh, sandwiches sometimes. So I, I cut back on the carbs. I got a, a cheese tray and this is the vegetable, not a cheese, why did I said cheese tray? Vegetable tray. It's got the carrots, peppers, uh, these are the, the, the um, what do you call those? The pea pods, <laughs> the, sweet po pea, the sweet peas, carrots, celery, broccoli, cauliflower, and it does have the vid, the, like the ranch dressing in the middle. So I got this. Of course, I got some chips. So I got a bag of the Lay's Wavy Originals. This is a 15, uh, 15 about, about 15 ounces. 15 and 7 eighths. Nice to be precise. Uh, 15 and 7 eighths, interesting. Okay, like why not just make it 16, you know? But, and then I got the Fritos, the original corn chips because, well, I like those. It's like the cinnamon buns. Yeah, and because our son might be down and because I love any excuse to buy this and it happens to be my son's favorite. I bought the Creators. Um, cheese and caramel mix, love this stuff. And this is a one pound bag. One pound, 13 ounces. Yum, yum, this stuff is addictive. Yeah. And of course I got hot dog buns. I got 20, uh, the 16 classic hot dog buns. Um, this is the Wonder brand. And I got 16 classic hamburger buns. Hopefully, well, I don't know how many hamburgers are, I think, I'm sure that'll be plenty. I am sure that'll be plenty. And then I got, oh, a bag of onions, and I did not need a whole bag of onions, but this is how it goes when you're shopping at Sam's Club. You could buy more than you need, um, and I'll split these with our family. So, big bag, and this is, it's the premium yellow, and this is uh, 10, is that 10 pounds? No. Yeah, 10 pounds. 10 pounds of onions. Too bad I didn't buy breath mints because we're probably gonna need them after we eat all those onions. And I bought some of these because I am gonna make John. John, plug your ears because it is his birthday in a few days and we are having a little family picnic, but it's not actually on his birthday. So uh, I did buy these store-bought brownies, although I will be making his um, special homemade brownies. They're just, it's just caramel brownies that I make. That's what I mean by special, it's his mom's recipe. And I'm gonna make those in a couple of days. But for the picnic, I just bought these and these were like $4.98. And I have never had these, but they look so pretty and I thought they would be perfect. And I didn't feel like baking. It is super hot and I really just don't wanna have the oven on. So that's how I'm rolling this time. And then I bought Kleenex just because we needed some and it's a 12 flat boxes of the Kleenex Trusted Care. Um, and this stuff is not, nothing fancy. We don't like the lotion and all that stuff in our Kleenex. So those, we bought those. Um, we got some fat tire and I'm gonna just leave this. I think you guys should be able to see this. We got the fat tire and uh, let's see, I don't know how many are in here, 24. 24 bottles of the fat tire. And then I tried this. I, I always like to try new things. I bought this Hint variety pack. There are 18 uh, in here, 18 bottles, and it's the water infused with fruit essence. And I'm gonna try these in just a minute and tell you guys what I think of it. I'll just try one flavor and uh, give that a shot. And then, um, uh, John, can you just hand me that the chips there? Yeah. We're almost done. Oh, it's hot. 
I got on the border um, jalapeno ranch. These are super good. We bought these before and these were super, super good. I picked up a birthday cake and uh, there were a couple birthdays that were celebrating John's and another family member. So we have, it's actually his brother and we're gonna celebrate both their birthdays and it is half chocolate, half vanilla with the vanilla frosting. I'll bake him his special homemade brownies, um, his mom's recipe uh, on his actual birthday, but for the family celebration, this is what we're doing. And we've had really good luck with Sam's Club cakes. Okay, I did forget, I bought a big can of these Bush's baked beans. And this is a big can. This is like 11 ounce, or uh, seven pounds. I don't know what I was thinking, but it had a really good price. <laughs> John's raising his eyebrows at me like, really? <laughs> but I'm gonna just put these in a, uh, Pot, I don't know, like, a, I don't know. I'm gonna cook them up. I'm gonna try some of this Hint um, variety pack. Let me just pull one out of here. Yeah, okay, so this one is uh, water, okay, water infused strawberry and lemon essence. So there's one with strawberry, um, strawberry, lemon essence. This one is uh, watermelon, and this one is, oh, blackberry. You can speak, John. Speak, speak, speak. Do you wanna try one? No. Okay. I'm gonna try the watermelon. You sure you can come sit with me? No. <laughs> he just worked out. Just got done mowing the lawn. <laughs> he mowed the lawn, he worked out. He did all of that while I went to Sam's Club. So, oh, all right, as soon as I opened this up, it smelled really good. Oh. Okay, let's try this. I'm doing the watermelon. Oh, that smells really good. That's actually really, really good. There, it's not carbonated. Do you want to sip? I'll try to sip. Yeah, it's actually, I like that. It's a very, just a hint of fruit. It smells nice. Yeah, it's got a really nice uh, smell. Mm -hmm. That's got a really nice yeah, mild. flavor. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's flavor. very mild. Oh yeah, this is really good. Mm. Okay, well, I'm giving this Okay, let's say five from a one to five stars. I'm gonna give this a five star. I mean, this is good. And I, I kind of like that it's not carbonated. Now I did review the, the Zevias and um, I did try a Zevia Cola, which was another, I bought a big box at Sam's Club. I've liked the Zevias as well. And I have been watering them down just a little bit. So, but I don't wanna drink a lot of carbonated uh, beverages and I'm, I'm really trying to cut down on the Coke Zero because you guys know I've really been sort of having those on a too much of a regular basis. I don't mind a treat now and then, but I'm really trying to par that down to maybe one on the weekend. So this is really, really good. I like the Zevia as well, but I think I like this even more without the carbonation. What do you think? Yeah, it's nice and refreshing. Mm, it is really good. All right, well, that's our haul, y'all. <laughs> See you next time. See you next time. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and that notification bell. And come back and see me on the next video. Bye. Bye. Everybody, you know, you, you can't have too many beans for, <laughs> for a backyard barbecue, right? Have our own fireworks. <laughs> Am I on? Okay. <laughs>